And we're back in the <clears> middle <throat> of a loading screen. I've been holding my breath for a week. This is the... I make my shitty joke in his face. His face is like, oh my fucking god. Why do I associate with this man? Um, so we only need to do two Patrick Socks, and we don't need to do any Mr. Krabs because there is one um, spatula inside the chum bucket that we have not gotten yet. Have we gone to Patrick's house yet? We didn't. We never went into Patrick's house. Do you want to? Yeah, let's go inside his house. All right. It'll give us one more sock. I noticed that while editing, that we didn't go in to get the one of the easiest socks in the... This house is pretty simple. I like it. And bam. In the couch. Look how he has a ladder to get in and out. Yeah. Yeah, his house is weird. In the show, it goes from being literally he just lives on the underside of the rock and then it slams into the ground to sometimes having an interior underground yeah. where you can go do stuff. Like in that episode where he meets his, fam his parents, but they aren't actually his parents, and then his parents show up at the end. Yeah. One more, Shane! One more! Yeah. So I'm going to go the complete opposite way. This will make it much faster. I'm going to be done. I think this is one of our fastest let's full-on Let's Plays that we've done. Yeah. It's going to be like four or five, six episodes. Excuse me. Yeah. Even though they're all going to be like an hour and a half. No, that usually get them down to 30 to 40 minutes. Don't care. That's exploding teachers at his customers? Yeah. What I never thought of that as being the customers before. Well, they're all the chairs. Yeah, I never thought That's of that. in the kitchen. Into the final boss. This video might be a little bit shorter because of the, the two boss uh, fights and then the uh, Spongeball Arena. Yeah, it probably just be too short. Spongeball Arena is so much easier to play around because of the jump. Yeah. And the handling is so much better. Head and... Short shorts? That hideous thing looks like me. Can we make a robot version of you, Shane, and call it a hideous thing? You don't need to. We have the real one. We have the real one there, too. Well, There's something mine. fishy going on. And I don't mean you. It's all over the place. Yep. I don't know why they included that. Alright, skip. I have a don't obey option. Right? It's a fucking idiot. Has an opportunity here. You gonna shoot me? Okay. He doesn't have a charging up sound anymore. Oh lord. Shares. Right on the fucking nose. These look like pimples. They do. Yes, you don't need to tell me every time. An opportuna teacher. Ha! <laughs> Bob is back in the fight! Which one? All of it. God, I wish you wouldn't say that ever. I time. know, oh, right? Man. Oh, Lord. No, for some reason it just auto fucking put it up on me. Really annoying. That's a pretty cool superpower. The Karate can actually be pretty hard to do, uh, dodge in this version. I don't know why it keeps telling me. Like, come on. It didn't do it that often in the original. Yep, I'm fucked. Now it restarts it. Yeah, you gotta wait a little bit longer for it to activate. Otherwise, you get fucked.
SpongeBob. This match is just about over. Yeah, it makes it a lot easier if you just wait. Yep. Okay. They also added checkpoints to the uh, inside part, so it, if you die, you don't get fucked, completely fucked. Yep. One more to go. He also doesn't say, that's it, now issue the coup de gras, or whatever it actually is pronounced. Yeah. Which I believe is the, the final hit, is what it's saying, now issue the final hit. Yeah, coup de gras. In whatever language it is. It is Latin, but... I thought it was French, to be honest. What? Thankfully, it gave me enough uh, room yep. to be able to do it. Wow, this video is going to be real short, considering that took us six minutes to do. Yep. Yeah. I won't cut. I want to uh, skip the cutscene. You know, robot version of himself, too. Great. Yeah. They were going to get married next week. I like his backup in Civil War, it's great. Yeah! I completely forgot about that. That was originally supposed to be a, uh, another boss um, stage, another yeah. stage to this boss, but they didn't end up including it. Which kind of sucks. Would have been cool to have fought him. But they would have had to take a uh, spatula away from somewhere else. I don't think they wanted to keep 100. Yeah. You actually need a lot more spatulas in this to beat it. Then it's what it's aping in Super Mario 64. You didn't need as many stars, yeah. or as close to the full amount as you did in Super Mario 64. Thank you. Well, that's some fucking what? Pro move right there. You wind up the ball, then turn to the fucking right and hit the dude. Jesus! That happened again. Remember we had a lot of trouble with this guy when we were playing it together back in the day. Yeah. I was watching some people play this and they had never played the original. It was just so cringy. Yeah. Watching them not know what the fuck they're doing. But yeah, they've added uh, checkpoints to every time you destroy... I think it's every time you destroy one of those... Uh, the fuses. Yeah. You get a checkpoint. Which, I mean, wasn't necessary. It certainly helps. It helps, but... I don't know. They didn't need to make the game any easier. They certainly did in some stages. We love all the gears and stuff. Make yeah, him work. This is fucking huge. Yeah. Actually, I have no idea how hard I have to wind up to hit him. That should do it. There we go. It also used to be uh, first person, that uh, the cruise bubble. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. You also don't have to do all the uh, things that it wants you to do with the fuses. Like you don't have to smash down. You don't have to go up. Yeah. The little rash. How many more fuses are there? Uh, this one, and then, and then the four in the brain. We're almost done. This isn't a, this isn't all that difficult. It's a lot more difficult than when I was a kid. I Absolutely. I only played this like once by myself as a kid. Really? I thought you played it as almost as much as me. Oh no, I, I thought you played it a lot. 
I may have played it once or twice. It wasn't one of my on repeat games. It was one of my on repeats because I didn't have a lot of games. And you had a rental store fucking right around the corner, so you were constantly renting games. And a modded Xbox that allowed me to download the games I played. Oh, really? The guy who modded it for my dad is still in prison. <laughs> okay. He got a lot of jail time for doing shit like doing that. Then again, it might have been drug-related offense. I never asked. I just assumed. <laughs> the guys that I was play watching play this for the first time, they their game glitched out, and they didn't actually get... Robot Plankton to show up in any of these uh, spots. So they were, and they also didn't know what they were supposed to do, so they were just kind of fucking about. But Robot Plankton didn't show up. They just ran away from him the first time, and then he didn't show up again after that. <laughs> That's hilarious. Whereas you have to deal with him at every one of these spots. I probably could have cruise bubbled him right away. Yep. But I am trying to make this last a little bit longer. Yeah, be efficient. Because otherwise. We're gonna be done. We're still gonna be done in fuck. Uh, inside twenty minutes. That's fine. I was like just playing it up in the corner. Can you? Yeah. See ever come back? Fire again, you'll soon you go in. Oh yeah, he is up there. They noticed that when they uh when they were playing too. He used to come back after enough time that you had to do one yeah. um thing. Get him. No. You have enough underwear. But if I get hit when I'm when he when I'm doing it, my bubble disappears, so. Fair. Now issue the coup de gras. Seventy seven spatulas. Game complete. Yep. And then we'll watch the last cutscene, we'll do the SpongeBob arena. And then the series will be complete. I am to die. He starts picking at his ear. Because it feels weird. What? Plop! And those are the arms that we were walking on in the multiplayer version. Yep. Also his face. Yep. Yeah, we did. What'd he do? He's just trying to leave. Gigantic way fucking butt. Yeah, right? Well, he is a plankton. Plankton are microscopic. There's lots of robots all over the bikini bottom. And now the duplicator shot is malfunctioning and manufacturing many of them. Well, I'll destroy you plus one. Well, I'll destroy you plus infinity. Stupid. I went to community college. So did we. Like how the hands are gonna sit still, they have to keep constantly. Yeah. Hope you learned your lesson. Oh, I certainly did. Next time I'll get it right. And <laughs> fucking Patrick Kalusa's ever just walks over and crushes him. Yep. Get him shift to put more weight. There's <laughs> still robots everywhere. Sandy is right. I thought she was a squirrel. I actually can't even do it. So. I know. I'm sure in a few years we'll go back and we'll play this together. At some point. Uh, no. Yeah, it's a few years. We won't be recording it, so... We'll play the remake. Remake. Another 20 years. Eight. Nah, 17. This time it'll be VR. Being directly into our consciousnesses. We'll be able to play it. I'll actually, it'll be first person, and I can actually run around to SpongeBob. Yep. And SpongeBob Arena. Which they remade completely as well. This is really, this is interesting. I never did, could do much in this because of how horrible to control it was. Yeah. But. 
Now we just have to grind out the other 30,000 uh, shiny objects to get into the, uh, the theater, Shane. Which is just some fucking development fucking shit. Yeah, I was curious as to what they included because it was original. It was stuff for the original game in the original. And I don't know what to, if they had anything they could uh, include this time. Because they knew they were... Because nothing got cut from this one. I'm gonna look so happy to be fucking contorted like this. He's having a bone. It's nothing to have. <laughs> Let's see the stands. What? Those are all People. Fishies with bull sticks. This is a rave to them. It just starts all over again. Well, there's other bits that you can do, but there's not a real point to. It does. Well, let's see. Is there a. In the original, there was a, like a, a platform that was put in the center of Bikini Bottom to allow you to go back to the SpongeBob arena. And I've never noticed that because I always just quit the game right after I do it. But in the PS2 version, I would play my old saves for some reason. There you go, it's fidgeting. What? There you go, it's fidgeting. Yeah. I have to fidget in order to not, you know, go crazy. You were saying, you do great with that pencil. You are make just like a bug right now. Right, yeah. Huh. You're like Bender from Futurama. You have to constantly move it. It's not even So I wonder how you get back to the SpongeBob arena, if you can. But we also never went in here. I always thought this was kind of cool. You can mess around with retirees? No, this is the police station. You can go and see Bikini Bottom is most wanted. You can check out all the robots. In the original, it wasn't Plankton, it was Robot Plankton in there. But it makes sense that Plankton's actually the one in there. Hey, you can actually look at all their names. Slick, Chompbot, literally called Fodder. Yep. <laughs> Hammer, Tardar, Sleep Time, Monsoon, Tublet, Bzzzbot, Arf Dog, Arf, Bombot, Chuck. And G Love or Glove. Yeah. Say about Plankton. Plankton. Plankton is the finest model citizen I know. He he likes helping people, singing, hacking computers. Uh, never mind that last bit. Plankton's the best. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That is pretty awesome. All right, guys. We will well, see you guys. Say me. What? Say me for me. Me.